The Queensland government says new laws will force Clive Palmer's companies to clean up the Townsville nickel refinery. An administrator's report has identified serious environmental concerns at the plant. And as Jesse Dorsett reports, taxpayers could have to pay tens of millions of dollars in workers' entitlements. Norm Napier doesn't need his uniform anymore. I cut the sleeves off and I used to do some gardening. <laughs> That's probably all it's good for too. After almost 40 years at Queensland Nickel, he was one of 800 workers sacked and, like everyone else, is still waiting for his entitlements. And he seems to be, the way Clive works, is, uh, he's like a spoiled kid. If he doesn't get his own way, he stamps his feet and this is what he does. So. The federal government may have to pick up the $73 million tab if creditors vote to liquidate the company. I think it is a disgrace that Clive Palmer may well get off the hook. But Queensland's government says new laws will save it from the environmental clean-up bill. The administrator's report found up to $12 million needs to be spent raising one cell of the tailings dam. And it says an exhaust stack is at risk of collapse. The government has moved quickly to introduce legislation into the Queensland Parliament in terms of chain of responsibility to make sure those who are responsible uh, for polluting and for contaminants actually clean them up. While creditors consider yesterday's report, which also found Clive Palmer appeared to have acted as a shadow director and recklessly, he says it's a big beat up. Mr Palmer has released documents that he says shows Queensland Nickel was contracted to operate the plant on behalf of two of his other companies. He says he was on a committee that monitored and instructed the refinery manager but argues that doesn't make him a shadow director. Clearly this is quite a disturbing report by FTI, by the uh, appointed administrators and now it's up to the creditors to make a decision based on those recommendations. The corporate watchdog is waiting for another report from the administrators to determine if a formal investigation is needed. Jesse Dorset, ABC News, Townsville.